Alright, what's up guys? Today I'm gonna be going over it's my first video, um, how to get how to erase pimples and uh, wrinkles and other imperfections that you don't like. So what you want to do is first open up GIMP. Whoop. That was on accident. And uh, open the healing tool, which is the little yellow <laughs> band-aid looking icon. Um, you want to get a brush <coughs> big enough considering who, different size pictures so you want to get a brush that's fit perfect for your picture <clears throat> and after you have that tool selected zoom in and you know select control on a clean area on your face and it will and then that will select that area and you go over the imperfection and it will <clears throat> blend it with that picture so it looks like it was never there so basically you do that with your freckles pimples any other imperfection um, We'll get to wrinkles a little bit later after I'm done doing this. So you see, it's a real simple process. It's it's pretty fun. I mean, it's nothing hard whatsoever. Uh, I mean, you'd have to be retarded not to be able to do this. So you just do that. Yada yada. I'll put out, take out some of these. <coughs> Edit. Yada yada. Take out some of these pimples. Mark on my face. So, yeah, I just did a quick edit in my face. Of course, there's a lot of different things I could have done to make it uh, better. But for right now, I'm just going to do this quick little edit. Now that we're done with the face editing, um, you want to get to the wrinkles, which is basically the same process. You just select a nice area and cleanly go right over the wrinkle. Sometimes if you do the wrong blending, you might get like a little purple or a weird little shade going into it. Just go back over that. And you see now the uh, now it's gone, and it sort of leaves like a, <clears throat> a glossy whitish fade over your, under your eye, which you can fix with more blending and more fixing, but I don't have the time to take care of that. So um, I'm going to show you. So basically, this is the quick way to do it. Um, of course, if you spend a lot more time, you'll get rid of a lot more problems, um, but... If you're trying to get a quick edit done or you just uh, want to look a little bit better, I just do this. <coughs> um, so basically that's it. It's a real simple process. I'll just click revert to show you what was before so we get a good <coughs> picture of what this looked like. And then this was before. So you can see a lot of differences in the uh, face and of course, if I went more into editing, you'd see a lot more differences. So, basically, that's how you edit um, skin problems. Um, thanks for watching the video, and peace out.